Graham, can you tell me um, why you would like to come and work at a, an international city law firm? Yeah, absolutely. So I think there's probably uh, three reasons. Uh, so first is, you know, I've obviously read that the firm has a lot of international offices, um, particularly in Asia and Europe. And so you know, I'm really interested in working abroad in the future. So I think that'd be really exciting. Uh, I think the second reason I'm really interested in, in business, as you know, I'm studying um, economics and law. I'm really interested in understanding the economy and different industries um, and how different businesses work. And so I think it would be, be really exciting to work at a, uh, at a company that, that does transactions and that buys and sells things. So I think that would be really you know, interesting. And then so the third reason is um, you know, I'm a very competitive uh, and high-performing person. And I think that it would be you know, really exciting to, to work in a, in a full-on and intense environment. This was a bad answer. Um, and unfortunately, it, it, there were aspects of it that we do hear in interview. For somebody who works in an international legal environment, the last thing you want to hear is that somebody wants to come and work with you so they can work abroad. That answer fails to recognise what is the real international element of our work, which is the multi-jurisdictional aspect. The other weakness in this answer was that whilst Graham plainly has commercial awareness, he didn't give me any insight as to why he wants to work in a legal environment as opposed to some other form of commercial or financial environment. Thank you.